Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Pathfinder Wrath of the Righteous Through the Ashes. We have made it out of the graveyard and we're now in the rich quarter of Canabras where the hospital and the town hall are that uh, both Anai and uh, Freda want us to go visit. And we also need to keep Brimmer away from the Inquisitors. So those are our objectives as well as finding a way out of here. But as of right now, let's head this way. Who's that? Get lost, or we'll fire. Maybe we should burn them. Come out. Oh, Stupid guys will put you in the name of the bath. bath. What's going on over here? Friends, Magistrate Pell Vesely. Magistrate. Halt! Who goes there? I'm warning you. We're ready to shoot. A portly, gray-haired man with a crossbow in his hand is shouting at you from the window. You see a few more people huddling behind him. Clearly civilians, but all likewise armed with crossbows. Who might you be? Friends or cultists? Freda. Magistrate Visily, sir. Freda is walking hurriedly toward the town hall, shaking the scroll in her hand. I have here for your urgent report. I, ha I have here for you an urgent report on the misuse of funds, embezzlement, negligence, and other crimes that took place at the theater. Inspector Lin Linstotten? Dumbfounded, the man stares at Freda. First through his glasses, then through his spyglass. You're alive. You even brought the report? My, my. It is my pleasure to serve the city, the queen, and Abadar. Freda bows with dignity, a proud smile on her mutilated face. More experience. The magistrate lowers a basket on a rope from the window, and Freda puts the scroll inside it. He pulls the basket back up, skims the scroll, and shakes his head in amazement. It boggles the mind. You are an example, example to us all. Once Her Majesty has driven off this horned rabble out of the city, and we have na returned to normality, I will see to it that you receive a, a letter of commendation. No, I believe a feat such as this is worthy of a medal. The cultists captured us, but we escaped. Could you share some, share some of your supplies with us? Who are you? Uh, what a preposterous question. Can't you see that you're speaking to the, a legitimate, to the legitimate authorities? Magistrate Pell Vesely. At your service. The man looks down at you proudly. This is the town hall. You you know, not some roadside watering hole. You won't find any rabble here. What are you doing here? We're holding down the fort to the best of our abilities. The gods have so far been kind enough to spare us from any demons. But we have yet. But we have had some cultists trying to get in. We gave them a few bolts for their trouble. But those sly miscreants could return at any moment. Fortunately, we have prepared ourselves accordingly. The magistrate nods at the barricade, barricaded door. Before you make any requests, no, we are not accepting refugees. We couldn't even if we wanted to. As you can see, the entrance is blocked to the point where no one can enter or leave without the help of a construction crew. If you require assistance, ask the Inquisitors. We saw their unit walk past our windows yesterday. Yesterday, No point in asking us. What's the news in the city? Terrible. But you knew that already. But if you want to hear some, some city gossip, the bureaucrat chuckles. Word has it that one high-born gentleman, I won't name names, but he, his is certainly known to all. Anyway, he threw a city day party that was so wild he actually missed the demon invasion. Can you imagine waking up after a drinking session, not knowing what's occurred, and wondering if your spree from the night before is the reason why the city now lies in ruins? Ah, Davin. The cult has captured us, but we escaped. Could you share some of your supplies with us? Well, truth be told, our own supplies are running rather low. But out of respect for Inspector Linsdotten, Linsdotten's great feat, we will share. Here is everything we can give for free. If you need anything else, I'm afraid you'll have to pay up. Oh, I'm sure you understand. Scroll of resist fire, scroll of blindness, and potion of restoration. Good. We let's trade. All right. Let's take a look at what you've brought us. Brings out a basket on a long rope. What a way to trade. Okay, so go ahead and sell bulk stuff. That's 11 gold. So, what do you have? You got a cold iron masterwork bastard sword. That could be good for us. It's 800 gold though, so never mind. <laughs> masterwork dagger, that could be good. Masterwork cold iron club. So, all the masterwork stuff is a little pricey. Club times one, or plus one, plus one weapons. 
All of this is a little too expensive for our taste, isn't it? Uh, but we could sell these things. Not going to get a whole lot from it, but we're not going to use them. I think we have all the weapons we want that aren't masterwork. Um, we'll sell that. We also have this padded armor. Okay, so we could get one masterwork weapon. With that. What about armor? What armor do you have? You have studded leather plus one. Can't afford it. Or banded mail, which is heavy armor. But we have full plate, so I don't think we need that. We can't afford anything else that you have. Who can afford this stuff? Seriously. Uh, you can have this stuff and that. We're not going to use this either. We have that. And we're not going to use that. There you go. 500 gold. Still not enough to get anything important. Or really good. Oh, this is too expensive. Get some potions. That could be useful. Okay. Do you have a Masterwork Scimitar? Hold on. So, Masterwork stuff. You have a Masterwork Club and a regular Longsword. You have a Masterwork Great Axe. You have a regular Scimitar. You have a Crossbow. You have a Crossbow. I think you're the only one with a masterwork thing that is being used right now, so. There's a masterwork heavy crossbow. We'll buy it. Hold on. Uh, we must go. May I better keep you? Okay. Okay, so we got you a crossbow. Masterwork heavy crossbow. Increases yours to plus six. Look at that thing. That's awesome. Okay. Um, loot their bodies. Ever burning torches. Is Freda still up here? No, but we can make camp right there. Let's trade. Uh, you can have this. I'll keep the torches. They might be useful. But you can have these too. Okay, so we can make camp right here. Do we need to? What is this? We are downtrodden. You are permanently shaken. Go after you take a rest. Okay. Let's take a rest then. Before we do that, Freda. Now that's what I call performing one's duty adequately. There's vigor in Freda's voice, as if she's gained a second wind from her success. Fifty years of service and nothing could stop Freda Liz Linsdotten. From conducting the inspection and reporting the, the violations. Not rain or snow, not illness, not even a demon invasion. That's right. How are you feeling? My condition is sound. I can walk, and that's what matters. Despite her brisk tone, Freda is not looking healthy. That's not good. Uh, what can you tell me about this quarter? If I understand correctly, where we are, the town hall should be somewhere close by. Yep, it's right there. Uh, you should really know that, to be honest. I guess you're blind, so whatever. East of here is a watchtower. It is, it's possible that you will find aid there, or at least some equipment. There used to be a, a grand estate to the northwest, but I imagine it was the first to fall victim to looters. There's something else, an alchemist's shop to the northeast. I'm sure you could go, you could pick up a number of useful potions there. Good. So east is the watchtower, northeast alchemist shop, and northwest is the estate. I have to go. Go. When you return, be sure to report your progress to me. Okay. <laughs> Anai. What a mess. What are you standing there for? Find my hospital and see if my brothers and sisters are alive. I won't get far without with my sprained ankle. I'll stay here and wait for n the news. How are you feeling? How awful. My damnable leg is killing me. Judging by her paleness and the feverish glint in her eyes, she's suffering more from just leg pain. Tell me more about this place. Sure, let's chat. After all, the burning houses are so pretty, and the cries of survivors are like music to the ears. And I tugs the strand of her graying hair and annoyance. Howdy, Strand. Fine, as long as it makes you leave quicker. I don't know much. Me and my brothers and sisters came to Canabras a couple of months back and joined a local hospital straight away. This is the rich district, so only well-respected people and good town folk would come to us. They paid and they paid and treated us well. They would talk mostly about silk, silk prices and the city's efforts to track down cultists. No one really believed in the latter's existence. As you can see, they should have. Alright, have to go. 
Uh, Bemir? Look at this. Look at these places. Palaces. Some people are living it up. Well, not anymore, I guess, but they used to, huh? Just look around. How are you feeling? A little off. Bemir wipes the sweat from his brow. I think I might have caught something. Hope it's not dangerous. Why are you scared of the Inquisitors? Inquisitors? Who isn't? You must be thinking I'm hiding something. Maybe I caused some trouble in the past, stole something from somebody, or called, called took, or called took the goddess's name in vain when I was when I was hammered. Not by a long shot. Clean as a whistle. I am. But it's all the same to those hounds. If they don't like your sorry mug, up on the bonfire you go. So I try to catch their eye. Not try not to catch their eye, and you should do likewise. I have to go. Good luck to you. Langrat, it seems like only yesterday that I walked these streets with my friends, laughing away. And now the city is in ruins, and my friends are dead. I don't want to believe it. I can't. How are you feeling? I can't say I'm in the best shape. I hope it passes soon. He's trying to hide it, but he's, he's obviously unwell. I'm not leading you any further. Leave. Uh, so you know some people in this district? I do, yes. I don't know if any of them survived, though. My old friend, Wheats Tamil, lived in a house behind the town hall. Yes, and there was also the house of Reverend Drayley, renowned patron of the arts. It's near the stables. If they still live, please kindly send them my regards. I have to go. Just don't leave me here. And then Brody. The money bags quarter. Haven't been here in a while. Brody presses his lips into a line. Not to gloat at someone else's misfortune or anything, but it warms my heart to see their mansions burning. They bury their de dearest cousins in silks and gold, but they can't spare a few coppers to pay an honest grave digger for his work. Skinflints. How are you feeling? I think I'm fine. His pale face and labored breathing tell you that he's not in very good health. What do you know about this place? Well, what's, what's there to know? It's where all the rich folk used to live, their cushy lives. You can sense the hostility in his voice. As for me, I didn't come here too often, unless I had business with the town hall. I'd stop by the bakery sometimes, but some cream, buy some cream rolls for the kids on special occasions. I hope our good baker's still alive. Uh, and the fires have spared his shop. I have to go. Alright, let's rest. Okay, we got rid of that. Uh, don't need that. Let's go ahead. Help with the camouflage. Begin resting. Come now, Sindri. Get a hold of yourself. Everything will be alright. Just keep your chin up. Oh, that's Sindri talking to himself. You've survived mountains, forests, deserts. You're, hard you're hardly going to meet your demise in a city. Most dangerous of wilderness. There we go. All rested up. Okay, it does look like they're still sick. That's not good. Alright. So we were headed this way first. First. So we're going to keep going this way. And this is to the east. Which is where the watchtower was, right? Sounds like a good place to start. Dilettante cultist. Okay. Try and avoid him. Nothing over there. Follow my steps. Hmm. I think we're gonna have to fight him. Cultist bully. Please focus. Red cart. It's you or me. You're not a threat. You're an obstacle. Good hit. Okay, good. They're not too strong. At least that guy's not. Move up. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Worked out. Oh, I've skipped her turn on accident. Doing terrible. Ooh, good damage there. Finished him off. Move up. Go ahead and turn that off. Get in here. Zap away. 
Yeah, we're moving slowly. And it's not just because I'm a halfling, because... Oh shit, I didn't see you up there. Good shot. Ow. Zero, get up here. Good. Zap. Fire. Good. Good. You should have run. Hmm. Attack. Stunning barriers kicking my butt. Away, you brigand. Oh. Got him. All right. Let's loot. What do you got on you? Hide armor. And light shield. And a battle axe. Okay. Club. Padded armor. Punching dagger. And light crossbow. How about are you hurt? Okay, pretty badly. Our duty calls. Got seven more uses of this. One more. Perfect. Okay, let's go up the steps. Looks like this might be the watchtower right here. Let's see if we can't find some good supplies in here. Hello. Go ahead and bless us. Move forward. Good. Move up to this one. Move in. Fire. Zap. Cam she come over here. It's you or me. Tickles, finish him off. Good. Are you still here? Don't hold back. Ow. Hands off. All right. We shall overcome. You're going down. Good sneak attack damage. Damn. No Gotta be careful, because um, Zero doesn't have the best of ACs. There we go. Good. Ooh, we leveled up. I'm so excited whenever we level up. It's great. All right. Another level. Level four. Look at us go. We're definitely going to be, you know, good adventurers at the end of this tale. All right, a level four crusader. You get access to level two spells now. Good. Oh yeah, it's level four, so we get one of these. Unfortunately, none of them are gonna make a difference here. Just increase your wisdom. And do those two. Good. Go ahead and take a look at you right away. Your spells. All right, so now you have... Okay. You have another spell slot here. Which you will get... Maybe another bless. Um, let's get another shield of faith. And then for this one... Hmm... Protection from alignment. Yeah, let's get that. Good. Next, our hunter boy. Who we have wasted his stuff, but we're going with it now. We're 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 in. We're in it now. So you get level four, so you're gonna have access to level two spells. Uh gonna increase your dexterity. 
Very good. And then these three or four. All right, level two spells. Bark skin could be good. Okay, I got a lot of stuff here. Spike growth is a decent one, but it's, it's, one, it's another one of those with a really long or large area. Since vitals is pretty good. I don't want to, I think we might just get like an owl's wisdom sort of thing. What does this do? Each time the creature successfully strikes an opponent with a natural attack, each consecutive hit gets the same opponent does extra damage equal to the number of previous consecutive hits. Good to know. Aspect of the bear. Take on the aspect of a bear. You get a plus two enhanced for bonus with the natural armor. And uh, let's get that. That's good for him. And, oh, we get two. Full strength. There you go. Sword Saint. We get perfect strike. At fourth level, when a Sword Saint hits with his chosen weapon, he can spend one point from his arcane pool in order to maximize his weapon damage. Don't roll for damage. The weapon deals maximum damage. This effect only this affects only the weapon's base damage dice, not additional damage. From sneak attack, magical weapon, property, spell strike, critical hits. The Sword Saint confirms a critical hit. He instead spends two points from his arcane pool to increase his weapon's critical multiplier by one. That's pretty good. Uh, did we get... That's all we get. Okay. And for you... Just keep working on that intelligence. Good. And level two spells. These are our first level two spells, I think. Blair could be good. Blair is a good one. Mirror image would be good too. We get two we get to pick two. Um Frigid Touch. Might be good. Hmm. What's better, blur or mirror image? Blur we can use on other people, so we'll get blur. And we'll get frigid touch. Okay. Sindri, let's see. You get your level two spells, so that's good. Very good, actually. Level or 20 charisma now. Perfect. That and that. Okay, a level two spell. So your conjuration, so acid arrow. I think is what we're gonna get. Glitter dust could be good. There's a lot of them. <laughs> He's got a lot of access to a lot of spells. I think we're going with acid arrow though. Okay, Rickart. Can you keep doing your thing? Rogue talent. Debilitating injury. An uncanny dodge. Dex. More Dex. And then for this one. Hmm. Urban would be good, I feel like. Ranger gets a plus two bonus on energy checks and lower nature perception stealth skill checks when he's in that terrain. Hmm. That wouldn't be terrible. That could be good. 
We get rapid shot. Mm. I think I want to get... I think I do want to get slow reaction. Good slow reactions. And then you? Get that strength up. And then I forgot myself. We get wild shape. I forgot. Level four is wild shape level. All right. Well, we'll see how how well we do with wild shape. And yeah, go with wisdom. I'm assuming it will help still with our wild shape to some degree. Wild shape, woof, woof. We should prepare. Polymorph, you become a medium wolf. You gain a plus two size bonus to your strength and a plus two from natural armor to AC. Your movement speed is increased by 20 feet. You also gain a 1d6 bite attack and the tripping bite ability. I picked the right thing. I picked bite, didn't I? What did I pick? Did I pick bite? I might not have picked bite. I might have picked claw. Damn it. <laughs> I might still have claw attacks. I think. I don't know. Does this last forever? Hell yeah. Look at me now. Yep, I just have a bite attack now. Damn it. <laughs> That's what I get for not knowing how things work, huh? Look at me. I look evil. Well, we'll see how it goes. There's a rope and a masterwork glaive. It's locked or blocked. Locked or blocked. Okay. To the city. Oh, hey, we're even stronger now. I'm feeling like we could just... We could do anything. Alright, we get another one of these. Give ourselves acid maw, right? I don't know if that actually works on me. Do that. Can I cast spells in Wild Shape? I don't think I can, can I? And for here, aspect of the bear, maybe? I don't know. Maybe bear's endurance, cat's grace. Let's get cat's grace. For your spells, you're good already. You just take whatever. Uh, we'll go blur. Okay. Let's move down over here. Hopefully we'll be able to like climb up the other side, maybe. Hello. This looks Okay. Let him have it. Must be carried out. 21 damage. Look at that. And they are now unable to make attacks of opportunity. Hello, everybody. I got Move up. This. 
You should have run. Get in there, Mara. Strike as one. I'll stop you. This wound might get to you. Oh no. And they just ignored me, huh? All right. Damn you. Good. You're not a threat. You're an obstacle. This will end. It is a bite attack. Hmm. Still here. Oh, I didn't think you needed to do that. Don't hold back. We shall overcome. No holding back. Critical hit. Holy hell. Don't hold back. Damn you. Okay, that was not a good fight. We lost a lot of health and stuff. Just health, really. But still, that wasn't good. Ooh. Take that and that. Okay. You need to do some healing. Okay, so I can't do this again. So once a day? Oh, we need to heal. Maybe I'm gonna be a, uh, a spellcasting druid. Okay, I think that's all I've got. You can do one of these. Heals this a little bit. Okay. So we got Knowledge World right there. A trivial task. Shards of broken glass glitter in the empty windows of the ransacked building. A shield has been nailed to the door, a sign that this house has been claimed by a particular gang and the other looters should keep out. Okay. We want to see if we can get up into this watchtower. Looks like there is a way up. Cast the rope at the wall. Okay. Ooh, we can push the barrels over there. We want to go this way first, though. Is this the other side of it? No, okay. What do we got in here? On the art of the siege. Okay. There's something here. Knowledge world. A trivial task. The dead knight was a captain, judging by the military honors he wears. His body is covered in wounds. It appears he fought until he died until he bled out. It's tough. Clear the way. Excuse me. And get this. 138 gold right there. And a masswork light crossbow. Hey, nice. Is this not a thing? Looks like a chest to me. And that goes out into the room we came in, right? Yeah. Alright, back to the city. What was in the northeast? Excuse me. Uh, the northwest was the palace. So I'm gonna go grab those. Ooh, it's good. It's good. Uh, okay, so what we're gonna do? We have one person ready. I serve the Crusades. Strange as it sounds. We can't just sit up here. here. 
And then what we're gonna do... We're gonna start the fight like this. Why couldn't you just shoot from down there? Okay. Move back, Rick Cart. You're going down. Uh, I'm going to zap Attack. the Vermlick. That's a demon. Push the barrels. What? Why can't I? I can't push the barrels anymore. Hold on. When was this? I have no idea. <laughs> I can't tell. Okay. I guess we just gotta we just gotta do it. That's unfortunate. That's good. Uh, fire. Ow. Guy's got a lot of health. It's you or me. Forwards. Away, you brigand. Good guy, always win. Ooh, with the crit, forty-two damage. Uh, I feel like I made a very good choice with my choice of weapon Attack. for that guy. There we go. Just got this guy left. And now you're dead. You're dead. There you go. Okay. Push the barrel. Do it anyway. Oh, because it started like a scene, I see. Oh, that would have been cool. That would have been cool. Alas, it was not to be. Use one of these. Uh, loot. Good. Very good. All right, where are we? Take all of that. Break down the door using tools. Don't have any tools. Be my last. I think I came out of nowhere. How am I supposed to know? It's you or me. Attack. No holding back. Strike. Do not hold back. Where'd you come from? Good. Aim carefully. Hands off, my friends. You should have run. Strike us. Don't like that reduced damage. Are you still here? Good. We'll take that stuff. Rainbow quartz. Isn't that what we need for the um? Hiding below the damn table, piece of dretch. Ow. Forwards. You're going down. Good guys always win. 
There we go. Being careful, everyone. Again. It gets a second attack. That's not fair. Any more? Yeah. Clearing out the dredge. Critical hit, nice. Another critical hit. We're kicking butt. Any more dretch? Probably. Follow my steps. Just looking for a way out of town. Ah, a test of my abilities. Hello. Ow. You're going down. Don't hold back. I got all these crits. I wish you were saving them, though. Cultist alchemist. Oh, it was an alchemy shop that was up there. Up here, maybe? Hmm. Do we want to fight him? We don't have a choice. I feel like maybe it's time we just start fighting things <laughs> instead of thinking should we be fighting them. Gotta kill the alchemist first. Damn you! Oh, that's an alchemist over there too. I see. Strike. We'll kill this one first, or try to rather. Attack. Oh, they weren't in the fight yet. Oh shit. How? Oh, I made a terrible mistake. Do not hold back. I've made a horrible mistake. Are you still here? You should have run. Uh, summon one of these over here. And hopefully that'll help out. A little bit. Ow. Ow. No, go after the alchemist. You fool. You're not a threat. You're an obstacle. Oh boy. Heal. Oh, we don't have selective casting, so that healed them too. Good. I got this. Don't hold back. Yeah. I'll stop you. I was hoping that would kill them. You're going down. That killed them. Damn you. Strike. Come on. With a critical hit. Holy crap. Are you still here? Attack. Hands off, my friends. You're not a threat. You're an obstacle. No. Oh, that's 
frustrating. <laughs> I don't think... I think we just lost them, right? That sucks. That's one of my best characters. I guess they're all kind of my best because... Uh, what do we do? Do we... I think she's just dead. Do we play this game like that? Do I do I do I play with like permadeath sort of thing on? Do I reload? I don't when was the last time I saved? I don't know. <laughs> Save it now. Load. It's the entire episode. Just about. That was when I rested. We're not doing the entire episode again. We're just gonna have to hope one day we'll get a uh, revive. My skills should I? are absolute. I shall not fail. We must act. We should move. Oh man. That's really bad. All right, well. We're gonna be at a disadvantage again. Don't go, stop. Don't go that way. We need to get back to the shop. I was just about to say maybe he has a raised dead scroll, but I just remember how expensive those things are. Let's head out. All right, there's a dredge. That's the town hall, right? The bodies of the unfortunate were torn to pieces relatively recently. The mob that did this must be nearby. Okay. Oh, maybe she'll get up when we rest? <laughs> she'll be treated like an animal companion? I'm bumming. I'm bumming bad. If any of them... Oh, God, it's so bad. Should I rest... Should I restart? Should I reload? Hold on. Hey, buddy. He has a scroll that removed disease. He does not have a scroll of raised dead. I'm gonna. Ah, what do I do? I'm gonna reload. I will be back when we are back where we're supposed to be. All right, guys, I'm back. Uh, it didn't take. Well, I guess it, it kind of took a while to get back here, but uh. We killed the. We just killed the dredges. We still have the alchemists. We're just gonna focus on this one. We'll worry about the ones over here later, because I think we can kill this one without aggroing the other one, which I think is a good idea. So let's go ahead, get Rickhart and attack. We did everything the same, so we we kept the level ups the exact same, all that. And I very dumbly did not save. <laughs> This this time, reach the market, experience gain, yay! Forward. No holding back, strike. Good guys always win. Strike Make a line. You're not a threat. You're an obstacle. An obstacle. All right, save it. There we go. We will take this stuff. Right. And that goes up to somewhere. Hmm. The mission must be carried. Take him out. With you. Critical hit there. I got 
Okay. We also have a wizard. Let me get to that wizard. Wow. Really? You should have run. Damn you. Attack. We shall overcome. Yes. You're going down. Good. The wizard's gone. Good. Aim carefully. Do not hold back. I'll stop you. I've got you. Don't hold back. Good guys always. This guy's got a lot of health. Forwards. Uh, let's go ahead and heal. Let's be safe here. Good. Good. There we go. Take that. What do we have up here? Call for Bimmer help to help. Call Bimmer help. Um, a little nervous to continue. Seems like they need help here. This will be quick. Who are these guys? Are these the Inquisitors? City Guard. Strike as one. You're not a threat. You're an obstacle. Okay. One down. Hands off, my friends. Attack. You're going down. Attack. Got the last guy here. You should have run. Good. We saved the city guard. We're amazing. Halt. Who goes there? Hey, we just helped you. Oh yeah, I forgot you're in the Eagle's Watch. We're on your side. We're trying to get to the Inquisitors. The Inquisitors? Good luck to you. We'll be here cutting down these beasts as a lesson to the rest of them. It's good that somebody still has the strength to fight. Of course, Ayamade has not abandoned us, and we won't let her down. You helped the guard on 25 experience points. We got... Crusader's Blessing permanent. Until you leave this area. Ooh, nice. That's actually really good. A short reprieve and then back to fighting. Don't get too comfy. We've got a lot of traitors to kill today. Knock. We are the ones who knock. Uh, fire refugee. Hey, a battered looking gnome wearing rags is waving at you with his bandaged hand. His hair and skin are halfway through the bleaching process and covered in specks of soot and dried blood. Despite his distress, he offers you a friendly smile. Where are you guys headed? Maybe we could go maybe we could go together. We're going where we're going. What's it to you? With a grim expression, Rickhart eyes the gnome and his companions, just as dirty and tattered as him. You go your own way. Hey, come now. That's no way to talk to people. Sindri gives the gnome the same wide grin back. We're looking for a safe way out of this quarter. Or just any way out, for that matter. Who are you? We're homeless, too. Looking for a safe place. You know, one where nothing is burning, exploding, or snapping its teeth. I guess that's a luxury these days. But one can still hope. Take a closer look at the gnome and his companions. Success. 
They look harmless, but there's something about their behavior that sets you on edge. When the gnome is busy smiling at you, his companion is shooting you, his companion is shooting you looks that are far from friendly, and you can swear he's gripping something at his waist. Let's just go our separate ways. Alright then, safe travel safely. The gnome's smile grows even wider, and weapons appear in the friend's hands as if by magic. Straight to the afterlife in the name of Baphomet. I knew it. Every time. Damn you all. It's the same thing every time. Rickhart spits on the ground and reaches for his weapon. Okay, so that's him. There's him. Okay. I'll stop you. We shall overcome. Luckily, the city guard's still with us. It's you or me. Damn you. Zap him. Here, hit. Away, brigand. Do not hold back. I'll cut you. Got him. Are you still here? Move back. Zap. Forwards. Don't hold back. There we go. Get out of here, refugees. Okay. Alright, what's up ahead? More of those guys, what's down this way? Hello? Well, that's not good. Some dretch over there. Follow my steps. Is this the hospital? Doesn't look good with blood tracks, does it? To the house. Oh, this is the estate, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's the estate. Um, let's wait. I'm gonna try and save that for the next episode. Let's just look around a little bit outside first. Let us be Got some sort of park. No. More dretch. Um, go ahead and heal yourself. And move up. Good guys always win. Oh hi. Can you charge him? Ooh, with a critical hit. Very nice. Hands off the friends. You're going down. Strike. Good job. A solid plan. I got this. Good. Aw, thought maybe we'd be able to kill him before we get to go. Damn you. Good. Attack. Coming in, coming in. Fire. Stop you. Fire. You're not a Good. You're an obstacle. This hurt. Good. Alright, that went well. And a body here. 150 gold and some potions and stuff. Okay. And that looks like it's the wall. Okay, what is this here? Don't want to deal with those guys.
knowledge world check there. Oh shit, they walked right up to me. I thought I was further away. Uh, ooh. Got gray pox. It's not good. Summon an ally. Um, go ahead and use this against him. This is a good hit. These guys are going to be kind of tough. Sheer or no joke. Ow. Another disease. God damn it. I don't want to have diseases. Aim carefully. It's you or me. Don't hold back. They are hitting too often. Heal. God damn it. You're not a threat. You're a good sneak attack damage there. Hands off, my friends. Do not hold back. I got this. Good, we got lucky there. Finish him off. No holding back. Strike as one. Damn you. Mint. Okay. One more. It's you or me. I'll stop you. Attack. Are you still here? Come on, guys, you gotta hit. Um, ah, Good guys always it's a mistake. Smite him. I'm yeah. Try this again. Good. Away, you brigand. Do not pull. Good. Okay. Whew. So we've got three diseases out on us, though. isn't good uh, and we are tired we're tired last healing spell right here did not heal for a whole lot I think we're gonna end the episode there guys in the next episode we will continue on um, exploring the rich quarter here it's tough out here I feel like we're getting to a part where there's less little uh, tricks to get past things and it's just straight up killing things it's getting tough but until the next one, hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll catch you later.